Now there are online calculators that can confirm if a player would receive an overall upgrade by changing their position, however that is a time consuming process, therefore I much prefer to use this method. Go to team management and select the player whose overall you are thinking of trying to upgrade. And then scroll across all the positions in your starting 11. If a positive number appears above the player overall, that is confirmation the player would be upgraded when converted to that position. And then head over to the squad hub and use the development plan to convert your player to their new position. Upon completion, they should receive an overall upgrade. When using this method for Youth Academy players, I recommend saving your game prior to promoting your player through to the senior team, and I will explain why towards the end of the video. Once the Youth Academy player is promoted to the senior team, use the same process in team management of highlighting the player and scrolling through the positions in your starting 11, looking for a positive number above the players overall. Use the development plan to retrain that new position. If a player is better suited to a new position, the conversion time should be quite short, for example between 2 and 6 weeks. Once the conversion is complete, apply the new position and the overall upgrade should be confirmed. Obviously, this conversion was done when the player had been promoted to the senior team. However, if you did save your game prior to promoting your player through to the senior team, you can simply reload the save and do the new position conversion while your player is still in the youth academy, which would help to preserve your player's potential from being negatively affected by not playing much. So that is a very simple tip on whether a player is better suited to a different position and if he would get an overall upgrade. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please remember to tune in next time, but until then. It's FCG out.